you think that maybe the official is going to throw a flag on a few of those? Uh, there's a lot of rules and a lot of things that go into the protocol that go into making that call. Uh, fortunate enough, um, though, you know, we didn't receive a call or had, you know, a call made on us. Um, and I think that's because, you know, the refs did a really good job of officiating what was actually happening during the play. Um, however, there are some teaching, um, teachable moments uh, with that that you take from the film, you pull forward, and, and you, you take and teach your players, especially your young guys. Coach, how big seven this game at home this week? Oh, man, anytime you can play the number one team in the country and you play them at home, of course, you know, you, that, that's an advantage that you got to uh, use. Absolutely. It's big. Sorry if we've already been asked this, but how have you seen Jason Prune's development over this first year at tight end? Uh, it's, been, it's been monumental. It's, he, he's, he's made some strides um, that from week to week that, you know, really uh, excite you about where he is in his development in that role. Uh, in particularly as a, a blocker, inline blocker, you know, on the perimeter. And, and when you have the ability and the versatility with that guy uh, because of the skill set to move him around, uh, a lot of that's on him to be in studying and, and, and grasping that role because in a game things change. And he's done a really good job of adjusting to that for us. You felt the recruiting kind of a lifeblood program. Like Absolutely. The Florida game was a big environment for a lot of kids. You know, you guys are going to have a lot of guys coming into town again this weekend. You know, what? how do you guys kind of, what's your philosophy on big games like that and kind of selling it to kids? And just what do you think the impact is on, you know, yeah. being able to show that, you know, you guys are on CBS at 3.30 again, four straight weeks. Yeah. Well, those things kind of sell themselves. Actually, you know, when when you're putting a good product product on the field and it's it's put being put out there for the the country to uh, to see. Uh, all we want to do is be able to control the variables that we control. You know, are we ready to go play football? You know, are we prepared? Uh, are guys playing hard? Uh, are we doing all the little things uh, that we control uh, as football coaches and as a football team? Uh, the rest of those things, the environment. Obviously, this is a big game. Uh, it's, t it's Tennessee. Uh, it's going to be 102,000 in there. And those things kind of take care of themselves. We control the elements that we control, and the rest will take care of itself when it comes to that. A couple more questions.